Today, I will explain to you the process which a patient follows when he or she is advised hyperbaric oxygen. I am Dr. Tarun Sani, head of the Department of Hyperbaric Medicine. The patient is seen by me or one of my team members in the outpatient department and the objective of that assessment is to ensure that the indication for hyperbaric oxygen is correct and that the patient does not have any medical illness which will complicate the treatment. It is our duty to ensure safe and comfortable delivery of hyperbaric oxygen to the patient. From the outpatient department, the patient is referred to the main department where we are now sitting. They come in here and they are received by the technician and the duty doctor. The technician will brief them on the entire process of what it entails, guide them on what are the do's and don'ts which have to be followed during the treatment. The duty doctor will assess the patient and ensure again that there are no illnesses which can complicate the treatment. Once the briefing is done, the patient is advised to go into the main treatment room and in the treatment room, which is called the hyperbaric chamber, oxygen is delivered by two methods. One is the hood, which is used especially for people with facial injuries where putting a mask would be difficult. And the second is the mask. Both of these delivery methods ensure that you have 100% oxygen delivered to the patients. The flow of patient of oxygen is designed as per the requirement of the patient and the pressure to which their treatment is again defined based on the indication of the illness. Once the treatment is to begin, the main door of the hyperbaric chamber is closed and the whole room is pressurized with normal compressed air. This compressed air is increased to bring the pressure inside the room for the treatment pressure which is designed by the treating doctor at what pressure the patient needs to be treated. Once the pressure is achieved, the nurse or the technician or the paramedic in the chamber as the attendant will help the patient put on the mask or put on the hood as in what is required and this treatment will last usually 90 minutes and in most instances after 30 minutes there is a break of 5 minutes so that the patient can recover or not feel too tired at all the time the patient is being monitored outside by the technician on the CCTV once the treatment is completed, the duration of pressurized oxygen is completed, the pressure is released and the room is opened and the patient walks out. It is completely painless and patients can comfortably drive their car and go back home or they could walk depending on what their other medical conditions are. And then we see them the following day. Treatment is safe and we to date have a very, very low complication rate and which has also happened in some patients who had complications which got aggravated during the treatment. But hyperbaric is safe and all our patients are welcome to come. They're given a card like this, which has all our phone numbers and details about the treatment. And if they have any queries, the team and myself are available 24 seven on a phone or on a WhatsApp message. And we ensure that the patient's queries are satisfied and we are able to deliver safe and complete treatment so that recovery takes place completely. Thank you.